major ports of India. The Indian subcontinent has fame in the world map in terms of trade since the ancient times. It was through the water route that various goods were imported and exported by the kings and the emperors in the olden days. British, Portuguese and other voyages came into India to trade with the countries rich in resources including India. The 7,500 kilometers long stretch of coastline extends from the state of Gujarat, Maharashtra, Goa, Karnataka and Kerala on the western coast and Tamil Nadu, Andhra Pradesh, Odisha to West Bengal on the eastern coast. The 12 major ports of India lie in these above-mentioned states and the 13th major port at Port Blair lies in the Andaman and Nicobar Islands. The major ports in India come under Central Shipping Ministry as per the federal structure of the Indian government. The major ports are responsible for handling traffic for about 74% of the total cargo in the country, including both exports and imports. As per the tonnage capacity, a majority of traffic has been seen in the ports of Vizag, Kochi, Chennai, Kolkata and Kandala. The highest container traffic is seen in the ports of Mumbai and Jawaharlal Nehru port in Navi Mumbai. Moreover, overseas shipping has an extremely important role to play in India's international trade. Now, let us glance through the ports located on the eastern coast of India. Haldia Port Paradeep Port Vishakha Pattanam Port Ennore Port Chennai Port Tuti Koran Port On the western coast we have Kochi Port Mangalore Port Marmagao Port Jawahala Nehru Port at Navi Mumbai Mumbai Port Kandala Port and Port Blair in the Andaman and Nicobar Islands. Among the major ports, Mumbai is the biggest. Kandala is a tidal port. Marmagao enjoys the second position by the value of the tonnage of the bulk of which is export of iron ore. Visag is the deepest land logged and protected port. Chennai has an artificial harbour. Kolkata has a riverine port. Now we shall study about these ports in detail. Haldia Port Haldia Port is a major seaport in West Bengal. Port of Haldia receives bulk cargo of chemicals, petroleum and oils. It is also a base of Indian Coast Guard. Paradeep Port It is an artificial deep water port located in Orissa. Port of Paradeep is a major port on the east coast and situated at the confluence of River Mahanadi and Bay of Bengal. Vishakhapatnam Port It is the deepest landlocked and protected port built on the coast of Andhra Pradesh. An outer harbour has been developed to handle the exports and imports of iron ore, fertilizers, crude oil, manganese ore, spices, wood, mineral oil, coal, luxury items and other industrial and petroleum products. In Noor Port This port has recently been developed to reduce pressure of traffic on Chennai Port. This is the country's first corporate port. The major items of traffic on the port are coal, iron ore, petroleum and chemicals. Chennai Port Madras Port is one of the oldest port of India and the second largest port of the country. It handles a variety of cargo containers, automobiles, coal, fertilizers and petroleum products. Tutikoran Port It is an artificial deep sea port. It is an all-weather port and receives a large volume of international traffic. Cochin Port It lies on two islands of Willingdon and Vallarpatam and is the largest container transshipment facility in Kerala. It caters to the needs of Cochin refineries, Cochin shipyard and Cochin marines. New Mangalore Port New Mangalore Port is a deep water port and only major port of Karnataka. Part of Mangalore Port exports major commodities like mangoes, greenites, coffee and cashew. 
the main imports include timber logs, LPG and petroleum. Marmagao Port It is a natural harbour and main port of Goa and is one of the leading iron ores export port in India. Jawaharlal Nehru Port The main purpose of this second port is to release pressure on the Mumbai port. The port is equipped with the most modern facilities and has mechanized container berths. The major exports are textiles, carpets, boneless meat and main imports are machinery, vegetable oils and chemicals. Mumbai Port It is a natural harbour on the west coast of India. It handles approximately one-fifth of India's foreign trade with predominance in dry cargo and mineral oil from Gulf countries. It is the biggest port of India. Kandila Port It is a natural sheltered harbour in Kandila Creek in Gujarat. The traffic handled at Kandila Port is crude oil, petroleum products, fertilizers, food grains, salt, cotton, cement, sugar, edible oils and metal scrap. Port of Port Blair Port Blair is the youngest seaport in India and one of the fast developing ports of the country. Port Blair is the principal hub for shipping in the islands of Andamans and is also one of the most popular tourist destinations with several places of interest. Brought to you by Compete India's Jeetu Bharat, a one-stop internet-based interactive coaching for civil services exams. For more information, log on to www.jeetubharat.com.